Hello everyone, uh, this is Mr. Popstarted, and welcome to Let's Play Paper Mario 64 for the Nintendo 64 console. Um, uh, I wanna, um, say, please comment on this video saying, uh, too much freezing! Okay, so last we left off, um, we got ambushed by this, uh, what was, what was, what was she called? Magic Koopa. And, uh, I think it's time we kick her ass. So, uh, let's go! And, uh, action commands. Action commands increase your damage if you hit, like, a quick time event button thing. So, pretty much when you jump, you have to hit A right as you jump on, like, right when you touch the head of the enemy, you have to press A. So, here, it's pretty much the same with head bonk. Look. You get... Oh! Oh, I didn't do it right. But, um, you can also block with the uh, A button right when it hits you. If you press A, it, um, gives you one defense. So, that's pretty good, too. Well done, Mario. You're as strong as I say. Um, also, there are badges that increase, um, I think, um, no mind. I won't talk anymore about that. I know that you'll be able to defeat Bowser. Yeah, I can. Wow, that was the smallest jump. I'm gonna return to Princess Peach's side. I'm not really strong enough to help her. But at least I can tell her. Okay, well, Mario, see you later. Okay, there we go. Oh, come back. Oh dear, I almost forgot the message. I'm alright, so don't worry about me. That's exactly what she said. I get the feeling, though. But she's very lonely. Anyway, I'll do my best to help the both of you. Be... But please be brave, you have to save her. Okay. So, uh, that's our introduction to action commands. Okay. So, how I... Okay. Um... So... We have to go back to Toad Town, and an event will be occurring there. Today at school, we are uh, reading Romeo and Juliet, and, uh... Oh, my... Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to skip that much. Um, pretty much it said that Merlin wants to talk to us, and he's in the spitting roof. Merlin is out! Why do you keep on knocking? I'm telling you he's out. <laughs> Oh, why are you sleeping? Very simple. Oh, yep, he found me. Mario impersonator! Um... Well, stop it. Um, if you haven't... If you don't know what Romeo and Juliet is... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to say to, about that, but, um... It's, uh, by William Shakespeare, so... It's pretty really, really famous. It's probably the most famous play that I know of, I guess. <laughs> um, but we were reading the script for it, and, uh, I was Friar Lawrence. And if you don't know who that is, I can understand if you haven't read it, but, uh, stop lagging. It's not even lagging, it's just, like, so pretty much he was just saying a bunch of random stuff that doesn't make sense. And, uh, yeah. Hey, Mark, were you listening to me? Nope, not at all. Uh, oh, alright. Um, so. But, Christmas. So we have to go to the fortress of the Koopa bro Brothers. To reach the Koopa Brothers fortress, head east on this road in front of the Toad House. Okay, thank you, good sir. Or, ma'am. I don't know what you are exactly. Stop lagging. Um, I could explore Toad Town right now. There's not really much except those two places I've already gone to. Everything else is like blocked off. Oh, well, this is east, right? Why? How? There's toads in the way. They look pretty gangstery. You don't want to go there. It's way too dangerous. Cooper Rose Feathers would be a great mistake. Yeah, don't go. 
most of all, you shouldn't ask Merlin for help. Hey, don't even think about it. I'm just sort of... <laughs> oh my god, why does it do this? Huh. So that toad's all like... I've never seen those dark toads over there. Hmm, <laughs> that's strange. Oh, and he's... Strange toads? That shouldn't be. It's ridiculous, I've never heard of it. So, uh, pretty much he goes out the door and we just follow him as Goombario freaks out. Whoa! Do this. Okay. Oh, it was just lagging when it was, like, on a black screen. Okay. That scared me. Okay, there's Merlin. And we're in slow motion, because the ROM is stupid. Oh my god, I gotta beat you there! Ha! Winner. I told you that you can't pass. Take off. Hmm, you aren't toads, are you? What? That's racist. You don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, what gives? Reveal your true selves. Magic lightning bolt. Huh. That's true. How did, how did that even work out? I mean, it's strange enough that they could fit inside a toad costume, but... How did lightning bolt make it come off? Retreat! Those imposters were the Koopa Brothers. Hmm. Oh. I would need help from a blue-shelled Koopa. I need help from a blue-shelled Koopa. Huh. That sounds like a, another partner. Hmm. Okay. Da, 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 da. Chapter 1, Storming Cooper Brothers Fortress. You can see a little silhouette of the, um, Cooper Brothers there. There's four of them, all doing the same thing. Oh, and there's a song. Okay, that's enough. So, uh, here we are, on our first road. Ooh, Koopas. I know what I have to do now. Oh, no, Chad! Damn it. Okay, well... These are Koopas. If you jump on them, you flip them over. And, uh... That reveals their belly, and they have no defense when, when they're on their back. There we go. See, that's how you do it. I'll jump on this Koopa. And, uh, yeah. And then head bonk this guy. And he's dead. Yay! Or yay, we murdered a Koopa. Guess I'm gonna have to do some editing there to include the bio for. Over. I know I'm sort of copying Chuck and Conroy, but honestly, um, it just seemed like a good choice to do that because um, I just got Camtasia and I'm editing with it. And that was my first video with it. I'm like, oh, what can I do to test it out? I'm like, okay, maybe I can do this. And then I put the biomes in. If you like them, if you like them, thumbs up the video. Because I'm awesome. Oop. There's a coin! Jeez. Oh, okay. So... In uh, times like this, you have to use a little strategy, since Goombario can't hit the the spike Goomba. You should use Mario's hammer. And oh, that was the actual command for the hammer. In case you were wondering, you just hold the left key or left stick. You hold left on the stick and release when the star pops up, so it's pretty simple. That's probably the easiest out of any of them. You know, it's this Dizzy Dial badge. Ah, uh, stop it. Oh, I guess it's not really... What does this one do? Oh, what's Hammer Throw do? Uses a hammer, so pretty much you can attack air enemies with a hammer if you use that. A blow that makes enemy dizzy and unable to move. Nah, uh, not very helpful, but it's, uh, pretty cool. Ooh, an item! 
we got a fright jar. Fright jars um pretty much make a giant like Bowser ghost come out and uh and make all the enemies run away, but you don't get star points for it, I think. Oh. Ooh, you wanna get the first strike on you? Okay, okay. Ha 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 ha! You're flipped. Okay, right here, I think it'd be a good idea to flip that one over too. Just because Goombara can work on this front one, and I can work on the back one. Because if we didn't flip those over, then we'd get attacked by the second one. That wouldn't be too good, would it? Oh shit. Damn it, that would've killed it too. Oh well. Whatever, they both die on this turn anyways. There we go. So, uh, yeah. That's what I liked about these games, the Paper Mario 1 and uh, Thousand Year Door, is that they, in the battles, you have to use uh, some amount of thinking. Like, not really quick thinking, I guess, because it's turn-based, but... Like, if you don't do it right, you could screw yourself over and not be able to attack. There we go. So, and that block was a... Oh, shoot. Well, here's a good idea. Oh, we use a POW block. POW block attacks all ground enemies with three damage, I think? Two damage, I guess. Yep, there we go. Do -do 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 oh, jeez. There we go. Oh, I should be ending these battles out. What am I doing? Okay, see so, ya. Yeah. Actually, hold on. I didn't, like, show this off yet. So I need this fight. Okay, if you press Z, you can switch. And right here, this would be perfect. Because Hammer only hits a front enemy, but the back enemy is a spike enemy. And Goombario can only hit um, enemies without spikes. So, if you use Goombario to attack first and attack that one, then Mario has a clear shot for his Hammer. And uh, that, that that's sort of the strategies you have to think about when you're playing. Of course, I'll show more of them off as we go along, but for right now, that's, uh, that's what you get. That's what you get. Oop. An item. It's called a sleepy sheep. If it works, it makes all enemies sleep for a while. That's, uh, pretty nice. Ooh, what's over here? Oh, I think this is something, a star piece, that we can't get yet. Yep. Is it raining outside? I don't think so. Wow, lag. I remember going through this place a bunch of times, and I remember... Oh. Yay! Coins! So many! Come here. Boop! <laughs> okay. Okay, that was a good amount of star points. Three enemies. The way I think I'm going to edit out these battles is, um... By... Like, once I get into the battle, it shows the enemies, and then I'm going to cut out, so... Oh, and this is fun! Like, you can um, pretty much go around this as many times as you need to, and it uh, drops hearts for you. And, uh, you can do it infinite amount of times, I think. Hmm. What was this one? What was this? A honey syrup restores FP, that's good. Sorta. Of. Except I don't really use FP that much, but once we get more badges and more attacks, then we can... Oh wait, what's up there? What's up here? Oh, we can't go this way yet, I remember. I'm not even gonna show it off. Ooh, okay, I don't... Uh, I don't remember the order for this. So I'm going to shape, save state, and uh, let's see. I think that's order. Yep, it is. Okay, never mind. I remembered, and we get the attack FXB badge. It changes the sound effects when Mario is attacking. Okay. Okay. Um, I guess we can try that out. I think it just changed it to like uh. It costs zero, so that's pretty, um, not 
it's cost effective. <laughs> yeah. And it does that during battle too, so it's pretty annoying. I'd rather just have the original sound effect. Or at least get a better one. Because that one sort of sucks, so let's go. Okay. Let's see. Can it be? Are you Mario? Welcome to Koopa Village. Yeah, we're in trouble. Can you see the madness that's going on? It's in the uproar because of the fuzzies. You don't know what fuzzies are? They look like this. How do you talk? Like, an image. I guess he just described it. I mean, mean guys over the dotty. Oh, sh Oh, you just got jumped. I <laughs> get it. Jumped. Oh, God. So, uh, pretty much you can just hit it with your hammer. And, uh, shell flies up and onto his back. Oh, thank you, Mario. Oh, you won. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> he doesn't want them to seal our overalls. Oh, what do I do? I don't know. Do it yourself, because this really does nothing for me. I wonder... Can we buy anything? Yep, I <laughs> guess we can. Okay, we have 71 coins. That's a lot of coins. I think we should buy one mushroom. And, uh... And I think we should buy two fireball... fire flowers. And I may or may not be saving those for the boss, because the boss is four enemies. And uh, that really helps. It's pretty much... Yeah, it's good. Oh, here's a save block. Okay, and then, ooh, wait, I, th I think there's like a Koopa leaf you get from one of these? Or am I thinking about something different later on? Nope, wait. Koopa leaf! Oh, damn it, I don't have that much. Sleepy sheep is very unuseful. 3 FP? 3 FP. Since we don't have that much FP right now, well, we have 10, I guess. Okay, let's see if we're getting... Unless I didn't say before, I don't remember. Oop. 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 So, pretty much it goes right here. So we wait for it to bounce in a circle. And, uh, I don't know if he gives you a star piece for it. I don't think he does. I think... Get ready for it. What? Oh my god, it's not coming over here. Oh well, whatever, I don't care, I don't really want it. So, what's in here? Nothing? Is there anything in here? Oh, Jade! I want to kill it. Oh, oh well. What's in that one? Nothing? That one? Nothing? So this house sort of looks like it's in an uproar. Who's there? I'm kind of busy right now, so he opens the door somehow. Uh, are you Mario? Oh, oh, my name's Cooper. I guess we're famous or something. Or everyone knows us. Yeah, Fuzzy took his shell. And, uh, too fast to catch along. Oh, he bowed to us. Thank you. Looks like he's in a bad way, I guess. Sure. Grab him like whoop. So, uh, ooh, New York, and, uh, shit, do you see that? He had a blue shell. If that's his shell, then I guess that's the guy we have to look for. Oh no, there's fuzzies in the distance. Okay, new enemy, fuzzies. I hate these things, they're stupid. I'm just saying. So, yeah, one power jump hits it, kills it. I think it has four HP total. And, uh, they're pretty annoying. Dang it. Yeah, and they steal your HP. So don't let it do it. Oh, they only have three. Okay, I know what I'm going to be using my fire flower on later. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, there it is right there. Oh, there's another fuzzy. Oh my god. I want to get the first strike on it or something. Look. This is awesome. Fire flower. I'll just buy more later when I get back to town. 
Okay. Huh, there's a badge up there. That badge is really useful, actually. And, uh, following the fuzzy. Okay. Me orc, me orc, come give me you can, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna F5 right here, and uh, yeah. Okay, he's in the far right. Blink. Ting. So, uh, you have to, like, follow the cup, or follow, yeah. Pretty much, it's that kind of game. Okay. Okay, he's in this one. Ding! Okay, this one gets really hard, the one after. But now it gets really hard, and it might be a little... Oh, he's right here again. Yay! Yo, no! I give uncle... Take the stupid shell. Cooper shell, we got it. That would be bad anymore, I promise. Maybe. Uh, okay, so we get a a new we got uh, we got his shell and uh, okay <laughs> so he's all angry at the fuzzies he wants to take his shell back and uh, okay here we did it for you yeah I got a shell uh -huh. You're the greatest. Dude, the Koopa in this show is the Koopa in this game is very, very more confident than the one in the last game. Hey, Mario, I have an idea. Do you know Professor Colorado? Dun dun dun.